ourselves, and in a free society, ourselves includes our leaders. Our next honoree has challenged us in our beliefs about religion, authority, war, morality, and language, and he made us laugh. His classic monologue on the seven dirty words you can't hear on the airwaves has forced many judges and scholars to realize that vulgarity is a communicative tool. Contrary to what our parents may have told us, sometimes vulgarity is a very good way of making a point. The Freedom of Speech Award tonight goes to the legend of comedy, the funny freedom fighter, ladies and gentlemen, the comedy legend, George Carlin. Ex Accepting on his behalf is a former writer for Saturday Night Live, the producer of Kids in the Hall, and a political satirist in his adopted country of Canada. And he's also the producer of tonight's show, Joe Bodelai. Thank you, everybody. It's an incredible honor for me to accept on behalf of one of my comedy icons and idols. And the reason no member of the Carlin family would uh, is not here tonight is because they're taking his advice and his advice is never attend the first annual anything. So they listen to him. George Carlin was the first ever host of Saturday Night Live and he brought a power of satire, passion and morality and honesty to that show that's still there today and is, is, is reviving. And that it's coincidental that the, in the year of his passing the, that satirical voice has come back stronger than ever. There are times when I wasn't proud to be on the show, but I've always been proud of George Carlin. He taught me something and I wanted to be like him. I became a political satirist and I had a newspaper column and my friends would ask me, well, why do you care so much about that column? Well, it's political satire. You can make 10 times more money on your TV writing. And I said, well, here's the thing about it. It's like George Carlin. In my little way with that column, with satire, I can help make evil a little bit more uncool. And what George Carlin did was make political satire way cool and freedom of expression way cool. So let me leave you with this thought about him for you. May evil get confused and lose their way on the way to your house. So George, thank you for everything. Thanks everybody.